What's good, Homer Squad? It's your boy, Homer Ziggy. We back here with another reaction. And hey, as you see, we got the one and only Peso P with a sequel, apparently, as he says, to Only the Strong Survive 2. Official lyric video, Jujutsu Kaisen. Now, I'm not, well, no, I, I remember reacting to the first one and such. And Damn well, that one was an experience. And if I'm not mistaken, isn't that like, well, no, that's kind of the same thing as a Sukun. But this one is mostly a Sukuna one and such. But was the other, but was the first one mostly Ojo base? No, it probably is, but I guess it's a different way or so. But Apparently, according to Peso P, he said this is the sec. He hasn't done a sequel to a song in over three years or so. So I wonder. Hey, sometimes whenever art, whenever rappers do a sequel to a song that they found popular, who knows? That song can. That song, in a way, expresses how they are. Well. That song either way shows their more creative side to their music and such. So, knowing and knowing how Peso Pete is, I wonder if we're gonna get written Peso or freestyle Peso. So, it's basically this. All songs, I wonder which one we're gonna get. So, we about to check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We on the road to 2K, so make sure you hit that subscribe button. And I'm out of focus. Now I'm back, but let's get in the video. Got three of producers on this. Yeah. I feel like Satoru Gojo except for the scene. Gave some imbalance on permanent lead. They was born frame one conceived. They had to adapt to me. Everything. Look at the flow, pick apart every beat. Watch how it tap from team. Try him a trick target, try to heat beat. Black on my face, there ain't nothing to see. I got hands on my waist, there ain't nothing to meet them. <laughs> Dang. If you want, try one that takes, bro. No. I gotta say, this beat. One thing with Peso. Reason why he's nicknamed Mr. Unorthodox for me and probably in the eyes of others too is because not only his like lyrical style, not only his like lyrics are unorthodox, his energy is unorthodox, even the way how he makes music is unorthodox. Because the fact that when he can have two or three producers on one song. Because you see, because most of the times you see why he does the two, two in one type of songs where you'll get like the main song and who knows, the next half of the song is either part of the song or something different on the side. That's the, mis that's like the mystique of Peso. You never know what you're going to get from this man. That's why we all like him. Yeah, I was born for one conceived. They had to adapt to me. Everything. Look at the flow, pick apart every beat. Watch how it tap from team. Try him a trick target, try to heat beat. Block mm. on my face, there ain't nothing to see. I got hands on my waist, there ain't nothing to meet him. Mm. I got hands on my waist, there's nothing to meet him. Taste, bro, don't give me a reason. I'm out of my mind, but you out of your mind. Wanna fuck with the guys? We can fly that we clean up. I'm smoking on gas shit, gear five got me geek up. You me with your mistress, Regina. Smoking on gas shit, gear five got me geek geeked up. Shout out to Luffy. Regina, I'm cleaner, I'm cleaner, just not my demeanor. You just an eager, I'm wool like a beaver. I'm different, I'm evil, I'm dang, different than evil. Revert as a heathen, they mad at my jeans, money blue through the screen. I have back then, they leave by this game. I use jeans at the top of the toad, I'm apex in a peak. Only strong survive, this shit out for weeks. I'm just on the ride, I'm bad for weeks. Trap that, dead that, fuck that. No. You know it wouldn't be peso peep if that nigga didn't talk about the saw. Only strong survive, this shit out for weeks. I'm just on the ride, I'm bad for weeks. Trap that, dead that, fuck that. Truth, huh. and if death taught me anything, watch how I hurt you. Finish my fights like in a way, this is like a mixture of lyrical peso and freestyle, and like freestyle peso because 
is like it's basically like this the energy of how he sounds on it gives off lyric the en like freestyle peso but like the lyrical content in it gives me written peso so it's literally um it's literally the gojo it's literally like the hollow popper hollow purple type vibe in search what i'm getting from this the red and blue <laughs> inconceivable truth and if death taught me anything, watch how I hurt, hurt you. you. Finish my fights like a flesh spark purple. Nobody mm. stopping that. Nobody topping that purple. My pocket. Please. <laughs> Dismantle. <God damn. laughs> See what I mean? I thought I was going to win that shit. My <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> and all it took was one hit. What a loser. I'm like, why would I hesitate? I'll oh, just murder my mind. So and then this nigga always doing that. You don't see a lot of rappers do that, that like that call and response type of feeling. I got that from Squiz John. Shout out to him. Where you know normally when you go into a crowd, once you sing like one part of a lyric, you want them to sing back. This nigga gonna literally click call and response to himself. Like and he does that every single time and it be fire. And all it took was one hit. hit. What a loser. I'm like, why would I hesitate? I'll oh, just murder my mind as a satellite. Watch how you talk to a demon, cause Pesha been honest. I really seen better days. So today I might let him know hesitate. Hmm. You ain't touching this swag, it's far away. Oh, that's your idol, we snatching your star away. 38 ballin', he thinks that he. <laughs> oh, that's your idol, we snatching his star away. Damn. Think that, oh, you think that's your that's your guy? You think he's gonna defeat. Think he better than me? Man, give me that. It's basically like this. Quote a daddy fat snaps lyric bar. Got your life. I, oh, I got your. I got your idol's life. Bitch, I eat it. If you know what that's from, I'm reacting. Close the door. Yes, please. Please and thank you. Close the door. Anywho, like I said, if you know what that lyrics from, comment down below. Watch how you talk to a demon, cause Pizzle been honest, I really seen better days. So today I might let him know hesitate. No, you ain't touching this swag, it's far away. Oh, that's your yeah, I don't think it's far away. away. 38 ballin', he thinks that he peak hardin', but he really hardin', that just play. They fuck mm. hard now, don't turn the page. Hardin', but he think he hardin' the way how he played. Mm. Shout out to James Harden, okay. Got that basketball ball. Rest in peace to Billy Mays. Yeah, what he said? What he said about Billy Mays again? I heard the Billy Mays bar. Oh, he said it in a pinch. I might peak. I might peak like ability blaze. Bet the map getting clean on. Man, and it's basically like this. Do you? I've always seen this like little video of a guy saying, "Man, I bench three hundred. I bench four five hundred pounds." Look, look, like you just said. With the tech, it no matter how much you bench, you can have all that muscle on you. All it takes is just one bullet and fuck. Don't you, you drop. <laughs> That's all it takes. Just one bullet. Drop. Smoking the bone. Ha. This shit is eternal. If it's like bring me your song, we killing them simply. I'm killing the curses. Your swag is my template. Walking them down with that tail. I don't care what you bet. Press, bitch, got a problem. We end that. Four hands. If it hit, miss, I reset that. More fresh. Bring out dead bodies. Collect that. More flesh. Bodies I cut. I dissect that. I was the go for so long. I had that so long. So now that I'm back, respect that. I was the go for so long. I had that so long. So now that I'm back, respect that. I had to play that shit twice. So be better. Listen, I'm up.
rolling up backwards your back. And look. I know people have their issues on the murder rap thing. But I f it's like this. I feel like if you're going to use it for something like this, I don't want to. I'm not trying to say that person who's rapping it is corny or whatnot like that. But look. All I'm going to say is. When it's on this type of timing, it's fine. I don't care. It is what it is. As much as. What it is. Your life and that my boy yeah, been that no won't die so even it's been back sending your bros and try to get get, get back throwing that back wood that's when you get, get back. back why would I hesitate you know my money is up as I elevate I'm on that shit back big back I'm gonna push jumps and I click that hit that my levels I'm okay get that you wanna fight like it's soul and will burn it but this motherfucking wheel turn fuck that play around you couldn't match my state now only thing fucked up peso is still learning still evolving still going still running still 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 what's in the head for the domain what's yeah he's still going yeah, with Peso, this nigga, it's basically like this, Pe like Peso say, how he keeps on getting better and better, he be minding his business and also minding, minding my business. Basically saying, nigga, I keep to myself, I don't get in other people's ish, that's their ish, I, I concentrate on my ish. That's basically what he's saying right there. Hesitate, hesitate, why would I ever? Man, show me the strongest, nobody better. Man, show mm. me the strongest, nobody better. Watch the last song. Hey, one thing with Peso, this man will always give you something entertaining like a mother sucker. Sorry, that burp came in. But, yo, shout out to Peso, Pete, man. And also, I already know, look at this point with Mama Ziggy. Y'all, it's basically like this. Who y'all love more? Me or Mama Ziggy? I'm going to I'm I'm call y'all out because y'all be, be something else. So I want to know in the comments below who y'all love more, me or Mama Ziggy? Who? That way I can expose y'all now. But either way, shout out to Peso Pete. It's be... I don't ever see him do, I don't really ever see just rappers in general ever do like a sequel to a song of theirs. Sometimes, like I said at the start of this, sometimes a sequel can really give a new, because in a way, the way how Fable did a reimagine and then Connor Quest did a reimagine, in a way this is a reimagine too, but not really, it's more of a sequel. But I always like that idea of how any artist wants to like come back on a even though it's the same topic but come back on it differently and such because that shows you how your elevation is as an artist how how your pen is of how your production is and so and such but hey either way y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below and if you made it to the end of this reaction comment down below See where I can comment down below. Comment down below. Uh, let me see. I'm trying to look. Bench press. Comment down below. Bench press. And that makes me know you made it to the end. But. It's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Make sure you go check out my other reaction. Right over here and such. It may be one or two. And make sure you follow me on all my socials up there. Because. I want to make that, I want to make my socials grow as well. So that way any underground artists out there, nerdcore artists out there that I haven't heard of can follow me. And if you want me to react to anything, look, you can hit me up on my cash app, a simple $5 request if you want to. And let me know what you want me to react to. But like I said, it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive. Keep the vibes up. Let go.